Hey friends, it's Essentially Jessie today. I brought my good friend Dawn. Hola. Dawn is like a master massage therapist. The fragrance is like, you're into essential oils. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I was thinking that. But not so much into like perfume, perfume. Like a lot of like freakishly ridiculous amounts of different perfumes. <laughs> She's more of a normal person. I'm very abnormal. Anyway. But you started in essential oils. I did. This yeah. was a natural progression. Yeah. yeah. So Dawn was my neighbor 10 or 11 years ago. Mm-hmm. And anyway, funny story. We like met and we're like, hi neighbor, hi neighbor, whatever. Anyway, we co parented for her a husband minute. was deployed, and one night there was a storm, and she was like, can I come over? And I was like, sure. And I mean, it wasn't five seconds. She was over there, she had her kid, her dog, and a bottle of wine, and I was like, I'm going to really like this girl. So anyway, we had a lot of fun together, and then we moved apart, like physically moved. And then anyway, so now we're just having fun. Yeah. Yeah. So anyway, I'm gonna spray like five or six perfumes on one of my little one of my little perfume sticks and she's gonna tell me what she thinks. So this will be fun and I'm excited that you're here. Me too. So. I know. I'm getting more than I bargained for, but now I just wanna touch everything. I feel yes. like I'm in a jewelry store. <laughs> okay, so let's have fun. All right, friends, so we are starting off with one fragrance that is uh, went viral last year. And the year before, and it has a flanker. Or right, here, I'll like take your hand and put it. There's a little paper. Okay, here. Okay, ready? Right? And then sniff it. Sniff it down here at this end. Mm -hmm. So you can probably smell it in the air too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was still that first bit of spray. Mm -hmm. You know, it smells kind of alcoholy. Mm -hmm. Okay, now I'm getting it. Mm. All right, what do I do? Okay, so yeah, tell me what you smell if you smell anything at all, or if you're like, I don't like it, or it smells really strong, or yeah. You know. So I, I, my, my vocabulary isn't quite as advanced as yours, oh so gosh. I'm gonna have to talk from not the massage world. That's good. Okay, so um, this one's actually pretty light. It, it went away a little on the quicker side, mm -hmm. um, and so what's left is very delicate and very simple. Mm -hmm. And I would say uh, there's some some underlying. Um, wood there mm -hmm. yeah for sure and man, the other one's really hard to tell it's wood and like a like a sweet wood yeah yeah you nailed it so. good job you're like <laughs> you're, you're great at this you're great at this so on a scale of one to ten how do you feel about it like would you wear it on a scale or like um, be excited about wearing it let's do yeah, the Marie Kondo I, like thing. I, the like, Marie Kondo does it bring you joy I I think um only because my wonderful partner my husband of a million years loves anything woodsy so mm -hmm. I think I would for him mm -hmm. if I were going out for a me date mm -hmm. I might move on to maybe some of these other choices okay I'm probably gonna bring okay me. So, so on a scale of one to ten what are we thinking um it's light. It's almost a citrusy woodsy now. Mm -hmm. It's changing it on changes. the paper. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So um, I think I would give it maybe like a fiver. Okay. It's, it's All right. sweet yeah. and simple. Also, if I were going to go to a place where I wanted a little scent, but I didn't want to be offensive with my yeah. smell. I think this is a, a polite Yes. That's smell. a good one. I'm going to hand that's that That's a good one. Yes. Okay. All right. Next. <laughs> okay. Here's this one. Sorry. Okay. You can't mm -hmm. see. I keep forgetting. <laughs> it's on there. On that end. All right. Already this one is more like your speed or not your speed it's just a stronger smell, smell. yes it is stronger okay this one has more of a candy mm -hmm. vibe mm -hmm. you're so good at this <laughs> um man it reminds me of like walt disney world or something like, yeah it's very charming that's fun i like that word for this i uh, think that's a great word for this fragrance Gosh, I don't have another word. I'm sure if you gave me the words, I'd be like, yes, that's what that is. No. Okay, so sweet kind of candy, um, mm -hmm. but not like a cloying sweet. It's not mm -hmm. annoying. So it has caramel in it, so that's the like candy smell that you're picking okay. up on. Mm -hmm. And then almost like a pink. <laughs> if the smell were pink, I would say this almost okay. pink. Okay. It was just a weird thing I to say. I could see that. No, it's pretty feminine. Like the first one you smell is more mm -hmm. unisex. Like you and mm -hmm. or Joe could wear that. But this one is It does have kind of like, it reminds me of like cotton candy. I think that's yeah. maybe why I thought pink or something. Okay. Yeah. So it's got so, sugar or caramel in it. Yes. So on a scale of one to 10, how are we feeling? A uh, little stronger with this one. Mm -hmm. It is very sweet. Um, it reminds me of like a younger lady, mm -hmm. kind of a teenager mm -hmm. lady, maybe a young college girl. Mm-hmm. Um, so I think it would be for that uh, person. I mm -hmm. think it would be a, a higher on the scale. Mm -hmm. They would probably like this more. Kind of reminds me of um, so 
I'm a little older. I'm, I'm an older person. No, she's not. That was going to say, it kind of reminds me of those scents that were out in the like, 2000s, those Victoria's Secret scents that were mm-hmm. out for so long. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It reminds me of that kind I of that feel, genre that feel. of yeah. scents mm-hmm. of you, the yeah. 2000s. Okay, so um, that that would be that. I think okay. if I were a young lady or a younger woman, I think I would I would probably give this a nice ten. Okay, but what what if the what they for me, we are today? Mm-hmm. For me, I'm gonna give it a lower one. I'd mm-hmm. probably give it something more around the long lines of like maybe five or six for okay. me personally. All right, we'll stick this at a five point five. Okay. Okay, we'll stick that at five point five. Okay. All right. Uh, sorry, friend. Here's this one. Okay. There you go. Mm-hmm. Here's my big strip. Okay, this is what this is. This okay. is what she's smelling. This, this is, is a left turn. This is different. Yes. I was trying <laughs> to. I was trying to think. Hmm. We're going on a scent journey. We are. And okay. I sprayed maybe too much of that. <laughs> it smells good. I like it. But so this one takes me like very like verbena, very green. Mm-hmm. I'm speaking in auras, I think. Because well, we're That's doing okay. the massage yes. thing, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. Speak massage therapist rates fragrances. I love it. Like, <laughs> give it to me. All the things. Okay, so this one's really changing and fading now, too. All right, we, we had a really strong, like, like, like almost a almost lemongrass kind of vibe happening. And now we're fading away into a crisp, tart... Again, grasses. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Cool. That's okay. Where I'm at with that. Okay. So, what, what are you thinking? Scale of one to ten, like, or I just took you in a different direction. <laughs> I was like, where Where do I go from here? Where she's like, wow, I love that. I want that. Um. Okay. So I, I'm gonna be hard to please. I have. I'm kind of. I, I tend to stick to my guns and my. Now, what do you wear? Stuff. Do you? What well, do you I'm, like? I'm, I'm gonna wait and see what you do. On the okay. Last thing. Okay. All right. Okay. So I still think this is very nice. I, it now that it's fading, I feel like this is also becoming more of like a polite smell. It isn't. Yeah. Um. Over the top. Yeah. So I'm gonna give this guy more of like a six. Okay. Um. Again, if I were a young person, I think I would like that one that was just before. But this mm-hmm. one, I feel is very gender neutral. Very. Simple and mm-hmm. fresh. I think it is gender yeah. neutral. I think the packaging is not, but I think the fragrance is. Yes. So that's one interesting thing about fragrance. I think it works better if I kind of spray it towards you so you can really smell mm. it. Not just okay, on the paper. Mm-hmm. okay, so this is this. Oh, wow. Another direction. So we're going like south this we're going very, all like, over the world. This feels very like Central America, very sandalwood, Cohiba. Do you know what that is? Mm hmm. White Copal. Got that vibe to it. Mm-hmm. Woods, 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 mm-hmm. but like specific, more like mm-hmm. uh, sacred woods kind of things. Mm-hmm. Almost like frankincense. It's got that mm-hmm. to it. Pretty sure it's got incense in it. Mm-hmm. Oh, and now he's going away too. Mm, vanilla. Mm-hmm. Gosh, you're good Almost at this. Like. Um, that's, that's about, that's about all I can say. Okay, I so think. one to ten, where are we at? The smeller might be gone. And there's a little bit of floral lift on the mm-hmm, end that brightens mm-hmm. it. So you don't have like this yeah, super sure. dark floor. So yeah. it feels almost like a sacred scent. Hmm. This feels like, like a really that. good, like a sagey woman who's mm-hmm. like very wise and chill and mm-hmm. calming, but like not dowdy. This, mm-hmm. this is what I that's see. That's who she floor. is. That's, who, okay, that's, that's who's that's, wearing that. That's who's wearing She's kind of hip, I love but she's seasoned. It. I love it. You know, she wears comfortable shoes, maybe, but. I love it. Okay, so I'm still one But banging jewelry. Bang. Um, banging. <laughs> lots of turquoise. Um, <laughs> I love it. <laughs> she's got a lot of art from Santa Fe. <laughs> Stevie Nicks. There you go, Stevie Nicks. <laughs> she's got a Stevie Nicks story. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, um, I can, like, I got a little soul sister with this lady. Um, I'm going to give this one more of an eight. Okay, okay, so yeah, we're kind of moving like in an eight direction. And the reason why I went up a little on mm-hmm. it was I like that lift at the end. Okay, all right. Yeah, that's kind of interesting. Yeah, okay. I'm with you. I'm with you. Okay, all right. We're going, we're going. I'm just going to tell you the personality of who I see. There you go. No, I love it. Okay, this, all right, is, this is, a, this is another direction. We're going another way. This one smells familiar, even. Okay, this smells like a traditional perfume. Mm-hmm. Much more traditional than these, yes. Yes. 100%. This, this one isn't, this is very grounding. So this one to me smells more musk. Mm-hmm. And kind of foxy. Foxy, yeah, I like a little bit sassy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I love it. 
I do not mean this in a bad way, but it almost takes me to a hairspray. Hairspray? But don't. That's. I think that's just. I actually do have this fragrance in a hairspray. Okay, it smells like a really, really classy. Yes. <laughs> hair um, serum. product or something. Serum yeah. Or something. Okay. Yeah. Yes. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay. So this to me just says uh, classic musk musk perfume for women. Mm -hmm. Um. I don't know what those notes would be called, That's so okay. I can't quite name them. No. I'm not going to associate them with, with foods like mm -hmm. I normally would, or grasses or tones. Mm -hmm. I would say it's very gold smelling. I'm giving colors That's to okay. That's okay. Why. Sometimes I say something smells purple, and I'm like, I don't know why. It smells purple. And <laughs> this to me oh. smells very gold. This is the gold okay. aura. Okay. Um, okay, so this lady has um, some inherited jewelry uh -huh. <laughs> in pearls. Probably so. Yes, yeah, probably yeah. so. Um, she has two accountants. Uh, one her husband doesn't. <laughs> know about <laughs> i'm loving this it's too much fun mm. she never wears the color fuchsia okay um no i'm teasing maybe <laughs> like a handbag maybe okay. but uh yeah so coiffed hair this uh so this i like this uh it finishes really really soft really mm -hmm. soft it reminds me of kind of some of the chanel fragrances mm -hmm. but not as harsh Mm -hmm. Not that they're harsh, but just a gentle, yeah. like it's gentle, it's soft, vanilla at the end and musk mm -hmm. at the end. Yep. That's what I got for you. All right. Nailed it. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I got one more for you. Where are we putting this on the scale of one to 10? Um, for you personally. For me personally, I'm still, I'm still not crazy about it because okay. I feel, I'm, so I'm going to put that down on more of a seven. Okay. I felt like that was a little more mature than what I would wear. All right. This is your last fragrance and I'm. Okay. All right. We're just going to do this. We're Maybe gonna... I'll get a bonus. All right. Okay. Where's this one? Sorry, Ooh, friend. Ooh, they're so hard. Okay. So this is what we're smelling. Okay. This smells really familiar. Is this like a common one? Uh, I feel like I've probably smelled Probably not one. really, but you may have smelled it. So this one's, we're going back to, this is very green apple, like heavy green mm -hmm. apple. Mm -hmm. Um, Sweet. Mm -hmm. Sweet apple. Uh, I'm trying to find you because you're yeah. like, you're like, some of these smell like a little too mature and some of these smell like a little too immature. And so, so this to me smells like this could be worn by uh, multiple genders, like ro mm -hmm. unisex kind of vibes, mm -hmm. um, office vibes, mm -hmm. uh, or just, you know, in a professional setting, maybe yeah. vibes, we'll say, because, you know, there's not that many office people nowadays. Yeah. Um... Yeah, fresh, clean, nice. School teacher. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Apple gives it the school Miss teacher Lippie's vibe. Miss car is blue. Um, <laughs> <laughs> no, I definitely think this, uh, this definitely gives me um, some elementary teacher, uh, but like a really cool elementary teacher. That would be too. a really cool like teacher gift. I, feel I that. think this is a good teacher I gift. Um, the green apples just sent me there, but also because it's sweet mm -hmm. and it's not really strong. It's like a medium mm -hmm. level. It's yeah. not, it doesn't like shrink away. So yeah. it's strong and resilient. Like a teacher needs to be mm -hmm. stand up to those babies, but, um, but not, you know, it doesn't like overtake you. Yeah. So that's what I would say. All right. So it's like vanilla apple, tiny, maybe tiny bit of cinnamon. Maybe. Yeah. Uh, one to 10. Where are we at? Um, if I am, if I am a school teacher. No, for you. Okay, yourself. for me, still, I, this, I would give this pretty low. Okay. Only because, only because it's a lovely scent, it's well done, but I would only give it a lower one because I don't want to directly smell too much like an identifiable food. Okay, fair enough. All right. Okay, so like the same yep. thing with my candles, like I won't buy a apple pie candle. Okay. So I'll give you one hint for me. Okay. Um... I got to see some of your other videos, mm -hmm. and I do. I love um, a really strong, complex spice. Those are the things I really like to wear. All right, we're mm -hmm. doing this. This is one that is relatively new to my collection. Mm. Um, you will really appreciate this one once you know what it is, but you don't have to necessarily like the fragrance. Ten. But... Ten out of ten. All right, this is spicy. This <laughs> I is love different. This. this is... Oh, my gosh. This I is called to... Put a Man on Me. Woo! Okay. <laughs> Put a man on it. I All love right. this. All right. So we narrowed it down. We found a winner. Yeah. I love okay. This. All right. I can't wait to show you what it is. All right. Um. So I would say this is. Oh, patchouli. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's. I mean, massage mm -hmm. therapy. Yeah. This. All right. Patchouli and. Again, I feel like I'm smelling white capal and. 
Mm, a little bit of vanilla, maybe even sandalwood. That's a lot. That's a lot mm -hmm. of spice. Ooh, finish is really creamy though. Mm -hmm. So that, I think that's why I love it because mm -hmm. it doesn't finish real hard. Oh, last week. Real harsh mm -hmm. and bitter. It yep. finishes really creamy. I love this. Okay. Yay. Merry Christmas. So I found Thanks your genre. Oh. Okay. Have all a right. Birthday. We're all done. You can take your. Okay. You can take your. Oof. Mask off. Oh that's yeah. Bright light. I know. Okay. It's bright. Okay. Oh, I got to smell the shoe. Yeah, you got to smell the shoe. So you smell. A juicy apple. That was the one you said for the teacher. I was like, that's perfect. Um, Grey Charnel, this is the very first one that you smelled. You said it smelled... Very light. Very pol It's a polite perfume. Yeah, you can smell it right there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so Grey Charnel. Um, the next one you smelled was this one. Um, and you said candy or candy cane. This may be all mixed up because I was spraying the perfumes all over... Disney. Mm, Disney. Yeah, you said Disney. It looks like Disney. Like, <laughs> caramel... Yeah, Cotton just candy, sweet, sweet. And fun. Mm -hmm. and, mm -hmm. Okay, and then this one, I should not have sprayed all these in this one direction because then it just <laughs> got on itself. Um, This is the shoe. Um, is this the mature lady? Uh, One of the mature ladies, I think you said. <clears throat> I think you said. Mm. I like it. It's a little bit sophisticated and it's, um, but you did say it's light and this is actually the legere version. The normal version is navy blue all the way to the tip. And so this is the lighter version of the original. So you, so I was you like, get that in a, I was like, like you're tone. nailing this. All right. So you also said that the this was like unisex, and I was like, <laughs> the packaging is very feminine. But you're right. A man could wear this. Like it could work for sure. Um, that's a hard thing about packaging is that sometimes, you know, like something like this is obviously like unisex, but something that's you know a high heel that's a little <laughs> more um, obviously leaning a certain direction. Okay, next was, this one was the one that you said I think the lady was quaffed. Like. Yeah, like like her hair. It was like, like she's, she's on point, this lady. Yeah, so this is Delina mm -hmm. exclusive. I wanted to yes. include this as one of the most popular fragrances right now. But mm -hmm. uh, I don't think that there's anywhere in the city that we live in where you can smell this. Mm -hmm. Maybe there's one spot. Um, but anyway, this is Delina exclusive. This is one of the like hot button fragrances right now. Mm -hmm. um, it's very sophisticated. Mm -hmm. What do they call it? Old money. Mm -hmm. very old, money. old money. Very old money. Very old money. Two accountants. Well, yes, two accountants. Yes, that. exactly. <laughs> um, and anyway, I like it a lot. She obviously liked it a lot. So your top three were Delina exclusive, and then we went to. These, this was the one that I filmed the video on while you were waiting on me, while you were watching. Yeah, I Liquid like Imagineers, and you were like, but you brought out all the sandalwood and the, and mm -hmm. I was like, man, this is really a lot more sophisticated than, like, I just think it's a pretty scent, but it is. I would buy that. I would that. bet by Liquid Imagineers mm -hmm. is so good. And then this is Tony Iommi's <laughs> fragrance with Zershoff, and it is, um, this is about three hundred dollars for this bottle. Maybe a little less. Maybe a little more. I'm not sure. So Tony Iommi co-founded Black Sabbath. So he's like hardcore rocker. That's why I had to get this fragrance because I knew that it was going to smell like spicy and woody and all the things. And she loved it too. And I'm like, <laughs> yes. Um, can't remember the last time I turned on Black Sabbath, but uh, it's, been, it's been a minute. <laughs> But now Black Sabbath can turn him on. Yes, can her. turn us on. <laughs> Woo! -hoo, we're excited. So anyway, so that's Tony Omi Monkey Special is what it's called. Monkey Special by Zerzhov. Zerzhov's a really high end Italian fragrance brand, and um, you picked the most sophisticated fragrance out of all of these. I kind of took you a lot of different directions. I was like. Okay, let's start with Grey Charnel and figure out, does she think it's like too crazy or not crazy enough or anyway. So I took you a lot of directions, but in the end, Tony Iommi won out. Who knew? A quick rundown. This is Kaoli Eden Juicy Apple 01. You can find this at Sephora. This is BDK Grey Charnel. Sorry, I can't tell you the names of them because I don't want her to know if she's like heard of it before or has it or whatever. BDK's Grey Charnel. Uh, this is House of Siage Passion de la Mar. It's in the green cupcake. Then we've got Carolina Herrera Good Girl Legere, which is the light version. Uh, Delena by Parfums de Marley, Delena Exclusive. Uh, Blanche Bet, one new to my collection from Liquids Imaginaires. And then Zerzhoff, Tony Iommi, Monkey Special. So that's the, the list of fragrances that we got to smell today. And it was so fun. So what fragrance do you wear? You told me um, you were gonna tell me. So I wear like, a lot of like? French fragrances. I tend to wear a lot of, um, Oh gosh, are they lighter? Are they more feminine? Are they more masculine? I think masculine? they're kind of medium tones. But are... now you've got me on. Now I've been rating my husband's 
cologne collection and mm -hmm. he has a much better collection than I do mm -hmm. and I'm not gonna remember the names of any of that's them. okay I but I know I know they're kind of fancy pants um I, so I tend to do I like muskier scents mm -hmm. for myself um, I, I have like the different, uh, Jador's, mm -hmm. um, Dior, I like their yeah. perfumes quite a, a yeah. lot. Mm -hmm. Um, so I tend to do those and then I, I still blend, um, I'll take, I have a vanilla perfume that I got, just like a drugstore perfume, mm -hmm. but then I'll take that and I'll add my own, um, essential oils because mm -hmm. I'll add the bergamot yeah. and Ling Ling and a little, like a drop of patchouli and kind of mm -hmm. make some blends. Yeah. Um, because usually I'm working in a spa environment, so I perfumes are not too much. But when I yeah. when I go on me dates, I like to have something a little bit more. Yeah. So whenever we first met, like every time now for the last what eleven years, mm -hmm. um, every time I smell patchouli, I think of Dawn. Like Dawn. Every so time. I like to say there's a lot of different kinds of patchoulis out there. There are. There are. There are. There are. <laughs> there's but like, some really obnoxious patchouli. No, I love patchouli. Um, but I realize I think a lot of reasons why women sometimes gravitate towards that is more because they want a lasting smell mm -hmm. that can kind of get into their body. Mm -hmm. um, and I think that if more people understood more about the different like perfume options out there mm -hmm. and the different um, potencies, mm -hmm. I think that you would see women um, even more, they just need educated. Yeah. They, they would be buying more yeah. and they would be doing They'd be making better options. Mm -hmm. I think we go into our local um, Sephora or our local um, department store, and we mm -hmm. go to the counters and we start trying, and we're not realizing that we're, there's different strengths of things, and mm -hmm. it's gonna it's gonna be different in an hour. It's mm -hmm. gonna be different in three hours. Mm -hmm. You're um, exactly right. Yeah, and so you know, and we're sweatier this time of year, and our body's mm -hmm. just gonna be right, the pheromones are gonna be acting differently. Yeah. So I think I think if women were more educated and men then um, I think you would see people not necessarily doing that. I think they, yeah. they go with those resin-based um, essential oils. Mm -hmm. So that's why I started my channel, because I would go into a department store or a store and I would pick up a fragrance and say, oh, this is $100, this must be fantastic. And I spray it once and it, oh great, it smells great, I'll take it. And then I would get home and I would be like, I can't even smell this anymore. I paid $100 for it and it was 20 minutes ago, you know? Yeah. So things like that or, it smells like apples whenever I spray it, but now it smells floral and I already have floral perfume. So I didn't want another floral. I wanted mm -hmm. a fruity one. So I really think that, you know, as I always say on here, like spray it on your skin. If you think you mm -hmm. want to buy it, walk around for 20 to 30 minutes, smell it again, see if it's worth it. You know, if it's $20 perfume and it's gone already, but you're like, ha, ah, I like the smell. I'll put it in my bag and then respray. It's 20 bucks, who cares? Um, but if it's, you know, 120 bucks, then you want it to last. So. That's why I started, like, part of why I started my channel. It's just, um, it's good to, like, be educated on all the scents, and then you can make good decisions. Well, and I think also if you're if you're a busy person or you don't have shopping access to mm -hmm. some of these nicer quality perfumes, you don't have as much opportunity to go even just experience one-on-one. -on -one. Mm -hmm. So it's nice to go have a little bit of an idea of what you're going into, have be armed with a little bit of that infrastructure yeah. of knowledge and then yeah. you can go and enjoy the shopping and get yeah. something you really love and then when you do decide okay that's kind of a lot but I'm gonna you know maybe for a special occasion ask for this birthday Christmas things like yeah. that then you can say you know I'm gonna treat myself I'm gonna get this nice bottle and you're not disappointed because you got what you really love yeah the lasts if you want it to all right thank you guys for watching don't forget to subscribe click the notification bell if there's another fragrance i should have thrown in here drop that in the comment section below if you have these if you love them if you hate them let me know how you're feeling about all of these like what would you rate them thanks so much for watching smell you later